Yo, what's going on? Just left the gym. Want to do a little video. I'm a little wet because it's raining. I don't know what coast everybody is on to watch this channel, but um, it is raining on the East Coast. And this is not like a really like a philosophical video. But like I told you, I text my brother every every now and then. We we will text and see how we're doing. Or will um, you know when you text somebody and it takes them literally. Like 40 years to respond back we sort of engage in that so i was asking him not to get all personal but i was asking him do you still keep in contact with like dad and his side of the family and the peers they're not talking and let me tell you this right now while i don't receive any negativity from anybody on here and negativity is not disagreeing with me in my videos or leaving a comment you know joking around that's not negativity negativity to me is blatant blatantly putting me down for what it is i stand for who i am and i don't i don't really feel that from people that watch this channel but for some reason i just feel this motivation because um he's not talking to them and i'm not talking to them and me and my mom it's kind of like on and off but what i'm what i'm trying to say is this this is just inspiring me more to want to do a lot with my life no i don't want to drown myself in drugs and alcohol self-pity because of childhood but this is just making me want to work hard work this job for the year. Hopefully everything turns out right. Get back into school, spend my money responsibly and be somebody. And this, and every day, cause I've been speaking to my dad, it's gonna be a year and a, and a couple months. And I stand by it because I just, as an adult, I see the wrong he's done. You know, I see the mistakes he's made and you, you view it a lot differently as an adult versus being a kid. But that itself, all my trauma is making me want to just work harder to be somebody. Because I want to tell you this right now. Like Denzel Washington in American Gangster. You're either somebody or you're nobody. Nobody hears you while you're sitting in that alleyway, smoking a rock, drinking a md 2020 or you shooting that needle in your vein no one hears you but when you have your education when you have your money right when you have a nice home when you have everything that to show for that you were here on this earth people hear you then people hear your story so what i'm trying to say is this you got to learn to forget about people because i'm inspired by my brother to just say fuck it you're in another chapter of your life and you need to just worry about you and you only. Fuck 10 years ago, 15 years ago, you know, 20 years ago. It doesn't matter. What matters is the present that we're in right now. 